Even when we got it close there at the end, they made every timely basket. Playing on their second night of a back-to-back, -back, the Boston Celtics just didn't have it against the Cleveland Cavaliers, as it was the tale of two halves. The Celtics fell behind early, but down the stretch, they were able to get back into the game, cutting their 21-point first-half deficit to just three in the fourth quarter and had plenty of chances to pull away. But the Cavs were able to hold off a late rally from the Seas and finish with a 117-110 to victory. We got, I felt like, really good looks early and the ball wasn't going in and you could kind of see our shoulders slump and, you know, they, they weren't that way the whole night. They were in a rhythm and, you know, they played a real physical, tough style. They turned us over in the first half quite a bit, but then they made timely plays where the ball went in the hole. And, and those guys, you know, Garland and Sexton are good players. Second half, we played more like ourselves. You know, we played harder, faster, gave ourselves a chance. You know, we all wish we'd have started that way, you know, in the first half instead of trying to come back from 20 points. But In the second half, we played more like you want to play, but credit them. Every time we made a run, um, even when we got it close there at the end, they made every timely basket. They made every timely floater. They made catch and shoot threes. They beat us at the end of the clock on several occasions. So. I think that was it. Rob Williams had to leave the game in the fourth quarter, but he did return. Post game, he said that he got bumped in the knee, but was able to run it off and stretch it out. And he's now feeling much better.